The harmonica cartridges had to be filled in huge scale, so in order to meet this task, the pump station was invented. So the pump station is a necessary device to support the easy greaser. Operating the pump station. Before we begin the instruction, be sure to have the following items within reach. A full barrel of Kluber grease placed on a pallet. The pump station itself. Access to 380 volt, three phase. Turn on the main switch on the side of the station. Turn the mode selection switch into manual position. Push the up button, causing the tower to rise. Keep the button down until the tower is in its top position. Note, be sure there is free space above the tower. Select the button to lower the barrel grip. Push the button until the grip is in its bottom position. Once the barrel is in position, push the button to raise the grip and grip the barrel. Keep pushing the button until the grip is in its top position. Open the air bleed valve on the tower. Turn the mode selection switch into auto position. The piston will now slide into place on the top of the media in the barrel. Close the air bleed valve on the tower. Now turn to the vacuum station. Mount an empty harmonica cartridge in the vacuum adapter and turn the vacuum bleed valve into on position. Activate the vacuum station by pushing the on off button. The cartridge will now be prepared for filling. Choose the amount of grease by pushing the F3 button. Use the arrow keys on the left side of the panel to choose the digits. Use the arrow keys on the right side of the panel to increase the amount. Once you've chosen the amount, press the Enter button in the lower right corner of the panel. Confirm the chosen amount and press the F4 button. Now pay attention to the display that will count down the amount. and grease will start flowing. Dismount the cartridge and seal it with a lid. Dismounting the pump station. Turn the mode selection switch into manual position. Push the up button, causing the tower to rise. Keep the button down until the tower is in its top position. Note, be sure there is free space above the tower. Once the tower is in its top position, Set the air pressure switch in off position. Remove the empty barrel and prepare for new installation.